Creator God, we heard about typhoons and flooding in the Philippines. We knew it was a tropical area and these things happened. So we said a prayer and sent some aid and carried on as usual. Creator God, we heard about storms and flooding in Florida. We were a bit surprised. We hadn't known that this too was an area where hurricanes happened. We didn't know that the numbers of named storms and hurricanes were increasing here. Or that this year there's been devastating flooding in the southeast USA, in Louisiana, in Mexico, in Texas, and even in Newfoundland and Labrador. So we said a prayer and hoped that no one we knew was on holiday there at the time and carried on as usual. Creator God, we heard about flooding in Central Europe. In 2005, heavy rains and melting ice left 62 dead. In Romania, it affected 43,900 houses. In Bulgaria, it left 14,000 homeless. In the Swiss village of Lauterbrunnen in the, Al the Alps was cut off. So were areas of Austria and Germany. We were shocked. This was Europe after all, but it was still a long way away. So we said a prayer and carried on as usual. Creator God, we heard about flooding in England. We were very shocked to see pictures of fields underwater, of cars floating in the street, of people being evacuated by boat and helicopter. We hoped no one we knew was affected. And we said a prayer and carried on as usual. Creator God, I heard about the flooding in Perth, how the water had flooded my friend's basement and they had lost their much loved record collection. I was very shocked and said a prayer, thought they'd made a bad choice of house location and carried on as usual. Creator God, I remember the storms which blew two people over the cliffs, devastated many buildings in Shetland and moved the roof of Lowex Methodist Church in 1991. I remember the Brer disaster in 1993 when a tanker was blown onto the rocks, but the oil was broken up because the t storm continued to rage for weeks. We were horrified, but we know we live in a windy place. So we prayed hard, but not long after, we carried on, as usual. Creator God, we saw the evidence of peat slips in 2003 in the South Mainland, and more recently in Urufirth. We realised that's what happens when there's heavy rain in peatlands following a dry period. We were astounded, but pleased that nobody was hurt when the peat swept down the hill and across the road. So we said a prayer and carried on, as usual. Creator God, we've seen flooding in Cunningsborough, in Skeld, in Lerwick and other areas on our doorstep. I've stood at the office window and watched the road outside disappear under water such that cars had to turn back. We've been horrified. We've prayed for folk affected, but we've carried on, as usual. Creator God, forgive us that we have carried on as usual. Forgive us that we have paid so little attention to the warning signs which have crept ever closer to us. Forgive our lack of understanding and our thoughtlessness as we see the effects of climate change. Show us, in the Western world, how to live simpler, better lives in tune with our environment. Show us how to take personal responsibility for doing small things which could make a big difference, especially if we all do them. Teach us how to be good stewards of your creation, because you loved the world so much that you breathed your spirit into it. You loved it so much that you sent your only beloved Son. Teach us 
how to love it too. In your name. Amen.